Hello and welcome to this session. In this session, we are going to learn how to remove variables in the R environment. Okay. In the previous session, we have learned how to create variables, how to create objects in R. Today, we'll be learning how to remove them from the R environment. Right. So, are you excited? I am definitely excited. So, why do we remove variables? Variables could be removed for various reasons. Okay. So, it's quite simple to remove the variables. You can use the remove function or you can use the shortcut that is rm okay let's get into our r platform and see how this can be done right now for example let us say i'm creating an object that is let us say j okay how do i create an object let us say i'm assigning a value for j that is j equals to for example 5 okay i'm just creating a object j equals to 5 right now for example let us say if I now just enter j what will be the output you guessed it right the output would be 5 now for some reason I do not want to keep this object j I want to remove j then how can I remove it just simply type the command r m okay in brackets put j right then you hit enter okay now let us say if I want to check whether it's there or it's gone I check for j can you see my object j has vanished now what happens is usually this frees up some memory so that R can store more objects okay although it does not necessarily free up memory for the operating system but to guarantee that the use of uh, you know which performs garbage collection or releasing unused memory to the operating system R automatically does some garbage collection periodically so this function is not that essential but still you should know how to remove it okay now variable names are case sensitive you should remember this which can you know trip up people coming from a language like sql or visual basics now if i'm just using different uh, when i'm using you know different fonts or different cases i can get different uh, for example let us try now let us say if i'm writing variable i'm creating an object okay this is variable okay now variable equals to let us say 17 I've created a variable 17 okay now I just want to see what is this variable I just write variable then what should be the answer you're right that's 17 okay now as I told you that's case sensitive now for example let us say if I write this in caps I am writing variable in caps now I hit enter error okay so you should keep it in mind that when you are creating objects the object should be you should know which case you are using okay now same thing if I want to remove this variable how will I remove I'll just say rm brackets in brackets I'll write variable okay now I hit enter supposedly the variable must have gone now if I check variable I hit enter the object is gone it's that simple okay so you should remember how to remove variables so we have learned how to create variables and objects and how to remove variables and objects okay so that was it for today's session let's get back so you can get in touch with me on LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter and you can write to me directly at rajeshdurbala at gmail.com We are running an organization that is Let Peace Proliferate You can visit our Facebook page www.facebook.com slash letpepro We are fighting both online and offline extremism Some exciting contests are going on Please visit, please do visit the Facebook page you can win exciting prizes. You can also get an opportunity to be featured on our wall of fame. That would be quite exciting again. Okay. So that was it for today. Thank you. See you soon.